ministry. I can. I can! We won't let the likes of you get revenge. Victory! We all won! We did it, Neptune! We were able to save both worlds! Thank goodness! Now Uzume won't disappear anymore either! Nothing will get in the way of my revenge! If I'm to disappear, I'll take the other dimension CPU's power along with me! No way! It can't be! For that CPU's power to disappear too? Damn it! Hey, Big Me, can't we do something with Grar's power? Krosti's power is only able to move people to different dimensions. It can't do any more than that. <laughs> what is it now? Everyone, this is bad. Look over there! <laughs> What is this horde of monsters? Their numbers are pretty staggering, and they're coming by both land and sea. They're all heading the same way. Where could they be going? That direction is... I believe they might be going towards the hole to hyperdimension. Why? We defeated Kurame and everything. Why is this happening now? That's because as she disappeared, she gave an order to all the monsters in this dimension to completely destroy Hyperdimension. She really frickin' went out guns blazing. What? That's totally cheating! What tenacity. No. At this point, you could call it malice. She had despised game industry to that much of an extent, it seems. It wasn't hate, it was just a bunch of misunderstandings and assumptions. You're always convinced so easily. Either way, let's get back to Hyperdimension. At this rate, all the monsters are gonna get through. We'll have to stop them. It's gonna be too late if we wait until we get to Hyperdimension. We need to intercept them. That's just impossible. We don't have the supplies or forces to face these numbers. Looks like she actually won in the end. No, I've got a plan. Gearsy, I need you to shoot the share crystal. What? Then all of you, hurry and get back to Hyperdimension. W what are you saying, Uzume? Yeah, if we did something like that, you'd die. Don't you know that? I do, but this is the only way I can protect this world. So please, Gearzy, your weapon should be strong enough to pierce that thing. Why? Why? Why are you leaving this to me? Your weapon is the only one that can destroy it from this far out. You've stood alongside me from the beginning as I've been trying to make my dreams a reality. I want you to see me through till the end. Understand. <laughs> I can't. I can't do it. I can't shoot. Nip gear, shoot. You need. No. I can't possibly do it. Why won't you understand Uzume's feelings? The reason she asked you, and not me or Keisha or Bisha, is because you're kin. You're her junior as the CPU of Planetune. But... but... but I... <laughs> Just shoot it, Gearzy! I can't! I can't do it! This is too heavy a burden to carry alone in the end.
I'll carry the weight with you, Nepgear. Uzume's entrusted dreams and her life. Nepsi. Neptune! Okay. Let's carry Uzume. Together. Thank you, Nepsi. Gearsy. All right, go! Everyone, head back to Hyperdimension now! Uzume, I'm so sorry! So many things have happened, but I'm glad to have met you, Uzume. Everyone is gone now. Oh, that's right. Umio, I have one last request. I gave an order to all the monsters in Zero Dimension to gather at our home base. Please, take all of them to Hyper Dimension. Are you planning to go alone? I feel bad I can't keep our promise, that we can't stay together. But you're the only one I can ask to carry this out. Say no more. I will see this through. It's a promise. And Uzume. Goodbye. Umio, thanks for always sticking by my side. For my sake. Nepsi, Gearsy. We didn't know each other very long, but it's been real fun being together. It's because of you two I've made it this far without breaking. You've really done it now, Uzume. How dare my dregs do this to me! Serves you frickin' right! I'm gonna make my last dream come true. Just stay quiet, like fleeting memories should. How can you talk of dreams after reaching this bleak end? Ridiculous! You'll never get it. But can everyone truly make it back to Hyperdimension safely? The Monster Horde will advance here soon, you useless tool. Bring it on! I just gotta hold them off till Nepsi and the others are back safely. I can make it happen. That's much better than just waiting and doing nothing. Why are you smiling? You're going to disappear as well. I'm just really happy. I was able to meet Nepsi, Gearsy, and the other CPUs of game industry. I was able to fulfill my dream. There's nothing happier than this. After parting with Uzume, we used the Gate East War open and returned to Hyper Dimension, Planetoon's Basilicom. We're back, Isti! What's going on with the monsters? The Monster Horde is steadily increasing in size while heading south from Zero to Hyper Dimension. It is only a matter of time before they're here. There's a crack in Uzume's console. Her main seal. Uzume. I was able to evacuate all of our friends into this world. I've kept my promise. Miss Uzume! No! I don't want this! Uzume! You can't die! You can't break! I'll save you! I swear it, I will! I'll find a way to save you! You can't let yourself break! <laughs> Neptune's desperate cries fell in vain as Uzume's console broke, disappearing into a beautiful light. It was almost as if it had finished its role. That was how the final moments felt. Eastwar, I've made some tea. Please, you should rest a while. Thank you, Umio. I will take a short break. How are those two doing? They have both been rather depressed, but are managing. They're slowly acting like themselves again. But how are you doing, Umio? Well, although Uzume has disappeared, it still doesn't feel real. I keep feeling, deep down, that she'll show herself again. 
somehow. But I don't have the luxury of time to dwell on it or be depressed. Uzume entrusted these Zero Dimension monsters to me. I must tend to them. I am sure everything will be okay, Umio. By the way, how is Large Neptune doing? Has she gone touring today as well? Today she said she was off to Loi. Apparently a new type of blonde manju has been released, and she wanted to try it. I see the Large Neptune holds a keen interest in sweets as well. Incidentally, what is on the menu today, in terms of tea? It's my special personal blend. Uzume enjoys this blend, and I'm quite proud of it. What you doing, Nick Jr.? I'm just enjoying the view. Looking out at the city we've protected. Thinking that Uzume probably spent time looking at it like this, too. I'm sure she did. It's totally a CPU thing to do. It's also the best spot to see the city. Neptune! Would you like some Neptune? Whoa! What's wrong? <laughs> I just kind of felt like yelling for some reason. But it's hard to yell as loud as Uzume can. That's true. If you want to yell like Uzume, you have to do it more from your stomach. You gotta yell from your stomach, you know. Make it cool and tough, Nipsey. Huh? What? Nipgear, did you hear that? You did too? I see. Uzume's watching over us. Please watch over us, Uzume. We'll make this nation and game ministry a wonderful place that will always remember you. Even if the world's forgotten, we won't forget about the CPU that was loved by everyone and sacrificed herself twice for the world. We will never forget that you were one of us, Uzume. You were and will always be a CPU of Planetune, Uzume Tenoboshi. Series annual thank you for playing corner. Yay! Clap, 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 clap. This corner is here for us to give our thanks to everyone who has played our game through to the very end. Now then, Neptune, Uzume, I will hand things over to you. Hey, you playing on the other side of the screen? Thanks for playing till the end. That was sweet. I may have died, but thanks to that, I was able to entrust my dreams to Nepsi and the others. Thank you. Now that you mention that, I feel like there's probably a different ending out there. You're right. Hey you, maybe if you keep playing the game, a new path will open up. You know, one where I don't die. Whoop! Well, our adventures together have now come to an end. Let's play together soon, okay? Bye bye